Hello and welcome to Monster Insights. Today we'll be showing you how to set up enhanced e-commerce tracking in Google Analytics for easy digital downloads. So be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you'll be notified when we post the next video showing you how to grow your website and reach your audience. Are you wanting Google Analytics to track your digital downloads so you can stay on top of your site's download statistics? Google Analytics Enhanced E-Commerce Tracking lets you get detailed information about your product categories, brands, and more. Enhanced Tracking lets you see your customer's shopping and checkout behavior, and you'll be able to use this important information to help you cross-sell and upsell your products. Plus, you can track the performance of your coupon codes and sales to see what's working and what's not working on your site. Enhanced Tracking allows you to quickly see who your top affiliates are, along with revenue, transaction, and average order amounts. Today, we're going to walk you through the installation process of the Monster Insights Pro plugin, show you how to connect Monster Insights to your Google Analytics account, and then we'll show you how easy it is to set up enhanced tracking so you can start viewing your easy digital download statistics right on your WordPress dashboard. So if you're ready, let's get started. To take advantage of your enhanced tracking for your easy digital downloads, you'll need to have purchased the Pro or Agency license and installed the plugin on your website. And you'll need to make sure that you've uninstalled any other Google Analytics plugins and removed any other tracking code that you might have installed previously. So first, you'll need to download the Pro plugin from your account's download page at MonsterInsights.com. Now, if you don't already have a Monster Insights account, you can quickly create one. Just go to MonsterInsights.com forward slash YTVIP, where you'll find that we've created a special deal just for our YouTube viewers. Now, once you've created your account and purchased a Monster Insights Pro license, you'll need to download your plugin. So if you're not already logged in, just head over to MonsterInsights.com and log into your Monster Insights account by clicking the Login link at the top of the page. Then fill in your login details. Next, you'll need to navigate to the Monster Insights Download tab. Now, once you're there, just click the Download link on the right side of the screen. All right, now after you've finished downloading the file, you can head back to your WordPress website and log in. Once you're on your WordPress dashboard, you'll need to navigate to Plugins and then click Add New. Next, click the Upload Plugin button at the top of the page. Then click the Choose File button to select the zip file that you've just downloaded from MonsterInsights.com. Next, click the Install Now button to upload the file and install the plugin on your site. Now, as a quick side note, if you have previously installed Monster Insights Lite, you'll need to click the Deactivate the Lite Plugin button. Then on the plugin screen, just click the Activate link right under the Monster Insights Pro plugin. Okay, next you'll need to click the Launch the Wizard button. Then choose the option that best describes your website and click Save and Continue. Now you'll need to enter your license key. You can find your license key on your My Account page at MonsterInsights.com or in the confirmation email that you received from Monster Insights when you made your purchase. Once the authenticating process is completed, Click the Connect Monster Insights button. This is where we connect Monster Insights to your Google Analytics account. So on this screen, you'll need to choose the Google Analytics account that you'd like to associate with your website. Once the screen loads, click Allow to give the Monster Insights plugin access to your Google Analytics account. All right, now if you have more than one website associated with your Google Analytics account, you'll need to select the website that you're wanting to track with the Monster Insights plugin and click the Complete Connection button. Okay, now once the connection is finalized, you'll need to review some simple Monster Insights settings, and then click the Save and Continue button. On the next page, you'll see a list of Pro License recommended add-ons. So if you like, you can quickly review these and then click the Save and Continue button. Now on the next page, you can just click the Skip link right at the bottom of the page. Once Monster Insights finishes checking your site, simply click the Finish Setup and Exit Wizard button. Okay, in this step, we're going to enable enhanced e-commerce tracking in your Google Analytics account. So let's head over to your Google Analytics account and log in. Now, once you've logged in, you'll need to enable enhanced e-commerce tracking for your website. So to do this, just scroll down and at the bottom left side of the page, you'll need to click the admin gear icon. Once the page loads, you'll need to click the e-commerce setting under the column on the right. Now on the e-commerce setup page, you'll just need to click the slider to change it from off to on and enable e-commerce tracking. Then you'll see the enable enhanced e-commerce reporting slider just beneath that. So you'll need to move the slider from off to on for that one as well. Now once you've finished, just click the save button. Okay, now we're all done with Google Analytics. 
Now let's install the Monster Insights e-commerce add-on. So let's head back over to your WordPress dashboard. Now on the admin sidebar on the left side of your screen, hover your mouse over Insights and then click Add-ons. Once the page loads, you'll just need to find the section that says e-commerce. And once you do, just click the Install button. All right, once it's installed, just hover over Insights and then click Settings in your admin sidebar. Now click the e-commerce link at the top of the page. Next, on the e-commerce section of that page, you'll need to click the Use Enhanced e-commerce slider to turn it on. Once you're done, just click the Save Changes button at the top right corner of your screen. And that's all there is to it. Now you've successfully enabled enhanced Google Analytics tracking for your easy digital downloads, and you don't need to configure anything else. Now keep in mind, it can take up to 24 hours before Google starts tracking your downloads. All right, now to view your reports, you'll need to click on Insights, then Reports. Then you'll need to click on the E-Commerce tab. Once you start getting data, you'll see an overview of your store with all the stats about your conversion rates, purchasing transaction, revenue you're generating, and the average value of an order. If you scroll down, you'll see your top product reports. This will automatically display the best performing items, the quantity that was ordered, the percentage of your sales, and total revenue. Using this report, you can make better decisions about products that you should be promoting to increase the amount of your sales. It will also help you to find out which of your products aren't selling as well. Next, you'll see the top conversion sources and the websites that are sending the most converting traffic for your downloads. Using the data from this report, you can identify sources that you should focus on more for promotions of your products. Scrolling down a little further, you'll see statistics regarding your customers, items that were added to or removed from the shopping cart, how long it took them to make a purchase, and more. And that's it. We hope that you found this video helpful in showing you how to set up enhanced e-commerce tracking in Google Analytics for your easy digital downloads. Now get started with the most powerful and user-friendly WordPress Analytics plugin on the market. Monster Insights is trusted by more than 2 million professionals to grow their business and offers a 14-day money-back guarantee. If you enjoyed this video tutorial, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified when we post the next video. In the meantime, you can follow us on Facebook and Twitter for more free tips, tricks, and tutorials for using Monster Insights in WordPress.